in my opinion, the difference between the standard version and the pro version is huge. Uh, I can now do um, instrumentals. I get up to 2,500 letters uh, for my songs, fully customized. What I put in is what I get out. I now get a high resolution album cover with every track. I can now delete uh, songs that I no longer want. I can shorten tracks. I can lengthen tracks. I can actually, there is a chat tab now on the pro version that if you have an issue, you can chat with the customized uh, service people. Um, there are quite a lot of pleasant um, surprises. So I'm going to try and explain each one. Um, and I'll first start with the custom lyric side. When you press the custom lyric tab, you will see that you have access to 2,500 letters to use for your song, which is a lot more than the standard version. Now you can type this in or the easiest way is to just copy and paste your song into the box and just let the song create the song for you. When the tracks have been generated, you'll also get two stunning album covers downloaded. And these you can actually copy and save for further use if you, if you wish to. For me, that's a great bonus that I like. You can now delete songs that you no longer want to keep another great added bonus that i use a lot if you check your files or your script you can see that your lyrics are all there. Nothing has been added or taken away. Everything you put in is there. It's customized for you, which is, which is exactly what I wanted. Another good feature that they have um, in the pro version is if you wanted to create the same lyrics in a different genre, there's something that you call reuse request. It's called reuse request. You click on that, it'll open up the lyrics again, and then you can choose whichever genre you want to recreate the song into. And of course, let the song do its thing. Another feature that you get is that you can now extend the song or you can actually clip it and make it shorter. I haven't tried these options as yet, so um, I can't speak too much about it, but I, I could, I'm just showing you the bonuses, the extra bonuses you get from this version of Songa. Like I said, I haven't tried this feature, um, so I, I can't really talk too much about it. I'm just showing you uh, what's available. Perhaps once I've done it and uh, see what it can do, I can maybe do another video. So this song is 6.2 minutes long, and uh, I can easily bring it down to whatever size I want to just by sliding the slider. Seems like a, another good feature. The song extension seems a bit more involved. Um, like I said, I haven't tried it yet, so I can't really speak too much about it. Um, if and when I do use it, 
I might do a video just to show you what it's all about. One of the things that a lot of people, including me, had issues with was customer service. Um, I've sent messages to them in the past and they never really got back to me. But with the pro version, they've included a, a, thing, a, a chat box, you may call it, where you can type in your concerns or your queries and you should have sort of quicker response time, I would imagine. I haven't tried it, so it's left to be seen whether it's an improvement to what we had before. Um, I'll let you, I'll give you some feedback if and when I do try it and, and let you know if it's a lot better than previously available on the standard version. Finally, I just want to touch on the instrumental side of things. I'm just going to put in a uh, something like uh, create a relaxing classical instrumental with violins and see what it produces. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with this. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention um, is that with this version, when you upgrade to Pro, you actually get 10, 10 songs. That's 10 credits included in the price. So that's not bad. Anyway, I hope this video was useful to some of you. Thank you for watching. And Perhaps I'll see you next time in another video. Goodbye and take care.